net net in the Holy Spirit. And so hence God by the grace of God will be taking sufficient time to pray in the Holy Ghost whenever we come like this. And then the remaining time we can use it to pray in our own understanding. If you understand what I mean. But of course, while we pray in the Holy Ghost too, we must understand that we should also control our mind so that our mind does not wander around. And how do we do that? That is the first of the mystery in scripture. And that is from um, First Corinthians chapter 14, where I think verse 9, where, where he said that um, I will, what will I do then? He said, I will pray in the Holy Spirit and I will also pray in the Holy Spirit. You understand that? So that is like doing doing two things at the time. So as you are praying in the Holy Ghost, you are riding upon the wings of the Holy Spirit to pray. You are also controlling your mind so that your mind does not wander towards food. Your mind does not wander towards um, you know maybe the dream you had in the course of the night, or your mind does not wander towards um, maybe um, some other assignments you have to do in the course of the day. But your mind is focused. On the prayer, my friend. So, what, what we need to pray in your understanding, we all know the focus of our prayer this time. It is about the, the, the country, it is about Nigeria. So, as you pray in the Holy Ghost, you are also praying in your understanding. Of course, your understanding is not speaking now, it is the Holy Ghost praying in the Holy Ghost that we are hearing. However, your mind is also praying in, in your understanding. And how is it doing that? It's also committing and placing Nigeria to focus that Father will commit this nation upon your holy hand, that you will transform this nation around. Do we understand? So by the grace of God, henceforth, whenever we come for prayers like this, we will be taking sufficient time to actually pray in the Holy Ghost by the grace of God. Hallelujah. So, let's uh, begin to worship the name of the Lord for today. Let's say, Jesus, we thank you for yet another beautiful day. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Father, we give you praise. Father, we give you praise. Father, we give you praise. Oh, we give you praise. We must be. 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 I want us to make some prayers to God for Nigeria from Isaiah chapter 2. Sorry, can we do well to mute our eyes, please? The Bible says, For the mountains shall depart and the east will. But my kindness shall not depart from thee, neither shall the covenant of my peace be removed. Yet, Lord, that hath mercy on thee. This for the mountain shall depart, and the hills shall be removed. Hallelujah. He said, But my kindness shall not depart from thee, neither shall the covenant of my peace Remove, say at the Lord that has mercy on you. So I want us to pray to God that Father, we pray for Nigeria this morning that your kindness will not depart from this nation. Because of your mercies, let not of your kindness depart from this nation. In the mighty name of Jesus, let's open our mouth and pray. Let's open our mouth and pray. You cannot mute your mic now and pray. 
in the mighty name of Jesus. Of the Lord Jesus, by your mercies, O oh Lord. We pray in the name of Jesus that your kindness will not depart from this nation. In the mighty name of Jesus, that your kindness will not depart from this nation. In the name of Jesus, that your kindness will not depart from this nation. In the mighty name of Jesus, Father, that your kindness will not depart from this nation. In the name of Jesus, let all shut the gate and the brand and the white and the legend of all shut. Let Fraga Fada get the 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 in the name of Jesus, if you ask the Father, you pray for the restoration of your money. In the name of Jesus, which is the restoration of your kindness upon the nation. In the name of Jesus, O Shadaka, O Shadaka, O Shadaka, the Lord that I have mercy on thee. Hallelujah. Lord, I worship it is no news <laughs> that peace in this nation is perfect. It is perfect. From one turbulence to the other, from answers to kidnapping, from kidnapping to banditry, from banditry. So many terrors. Hallelujah. So we're going to pray to God this morning and say, Father, please restore your covenant of peace back to Nigeria. Especially in the forthcoming election, we declare in the name of Jesus that it shall be peace all true. It shall be peaceful all true. There shall be no terror recorded. There shall be no no um, hazards recorded in the course of the coming election. In the mighty name of Jesus, restore your covenant of peace back to Nigeria. 
Open your mouth and pray in the name of Jesus. Let go shut the cut up at the Bayaga the Bodo de Gotabosa. Reck at the Yagata Bodo de Gotta Yoda de Gotabosa. Father, restore your covenant of peace back to Nigeria. In the mighty name of Jesus, restore your covenant of peace back to Nigeria. In the mighty name of Especially in the coming election, oh Lord, let peace pray in the name of Jesus. An election shall it be in the mighty name of Jesus. Let all shut the We are tired of nothing today. We are tired of fasting tomorrow. We are tired of all the things that are happening in the nation. Father, please restore your covenant of peace. Restore your covenant of peace to Nigeria. Restore your covenant of peace to Nigeria. At that time returns uh, when men can move easily and, be, and, 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 and not be mindful of any peril. In the name of Jesus. Uh, Hallelujah. The word in that scripture says, My covenant, or the covenant rather, of my peace. Now, we all know that in every covenant, there are always two parties involved. In every covenant, there can be a covenant with just one individual involved. And it is always between a superior individual and a subordinate. Hallelujah. Now, it were very possible for God to play his own part to make sure that his covenant of peace being stated in the nation. While those of us that are the subordinate have failed to play our own part. Hallelujah. 
so although god is there yes yeah, true he has played his part but somehow there are people that are placed in places who have decided to not play their part by doing the opposite and some of them because of political powers some of them because they want money because of their their selfish interest for money some of them because of whatever it is they are looking for will be the ones causing or instituting all the terrors and bad locks that have befallen the nation although god is there in heaven watching while he is still keeping his own part of the covenant so we're going to pray to god father please grant unto us leaders in the coming election who will be ready to play their part in making sure that peace is restored to this nation grant unto us leaders who ask the 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 the, the people who has the masses in uh, in mind not not people who are only concerned about their own pockets alone but people who have the masses at heart and are ready to do whatever it takes to make sure that peace is restored in this nation. In the name of Jesus, let's open our, let's open our mouths and pray. In the name of Jesus, let go shut the get the yagana bana gana bosa get the 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 gana yagana bosa shut the get Father, grant unto us leaders who have the masses of God. In the name of Jesus, men and women will be ready to play their role. Men and women will be ready to re- ready to play their part in making sure that your covenant of peace is restored in this nation. In the mighty name of Jesus, grant unto us true leaders. In the name of Jesus, men with the heart of the for the people, men with the heart of the people and for the people. In the mighty name of Jesus, women with the heart of the people and of the people. In the name of Jesus, let us shut the gates of the Let us take the yagat of the heaven. Man, break it down, shut the gates. Yagat the gate, the doors are shut. Men who believe. Oh, your covenant of peace to this nation. Name of Mata it's the name of Jesus. It's the name of Jesus. And the name of Jesus. It's 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 the name of Jesus. In our private Men and women with the heart for the people. In the name of Jesus. Men and women with the heart of the people. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus, mighty name, we are still praying. And let's jump to verse 14 of Isaiah 54. Verse 14. It's already on the, on the uh, chart. The Bible says, In righteousness 
shalt thou be established. Thou shalt be far from oppression, for thou shalt not fear, and from terror, for it shall not come near thee. <laughs> he says, In righteousness shall Nigeria be established. He says, Nigeria shall be far from oppression. Nigeria and Nigerians shall be far from oppression. He said, For Nigeria and Nigerians will no longer fear. He says, And from terror, Nigeria and Nigerians will be will be safe from it it will not come near us so we pray to god this morning that father please establish this nation in righteousness establish this nation in righteousness let righteousness reign once again in nigeria in the mighty name of jesus establish nigeria in righteousness establish nigerians in righteousness in the name of jesus open your mouth and pray in the name of Jesus, let right you live in the honor of the day in this nation. The job to the bottom. In the mighty name of Jesus, let right just live in become the honor of the day in Nigeria. From top to bottom. In the name of Jesus, let go In the name of Jesus, Nigerians are righteous. Nigerians are righteous. In the name of Jesus, let me give you a Thank you, Jesus. Jesus, my name. We are still praying. Amen. It says, Thou shalt be far from oppression. Thou shalt be far from oppression. Let's pray to God this morning. Father, every oppression that we have been placed under in Nigeria, Father, deliver us from it. Deliver us from every form of oppression. Deliver us from every form of oppression in this nation. In the mighty name of Jesus, huh? open your mouth and pray. Laka to shut the cat. Yet get the get the get the bosha. Yet get the get the get the get the get Father, the Lord, deliver us from every oppression, the oppression of poverty, the oppression of insecurity, the oppression. Oh no, 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 no,
Thank you, Father. In Jesus' mighty name, we are still praying. Amen. Let's tell it to God. The Father, let terror not let terror be far from us in this nation. Let terror be far from us in Nigeria. Let terror be, be far. Let it be far away from us. In the name of Jesus, no longer shall any form of terror be held within the borders of this nation. In the name of Jesus, let's open our mouth and pray in Jesus' name. Makatosha dakata, Thank you, Holy Spirit. Yeah, we'll go ahead and begin to open the name of the Lord for answer and prayers this morning. Let's give him all the praise that he needs to do. Let's give him all the adoration for the good of the Lord. Let's take him for the good of the Lord. Let's give him all the love he has for the good of the Lord. Let's appreciate his name. Let's give him all the praise and part to thank you. Let's give you all the praise for all our prayers. Yet the team of the name in the name of Jesus. We begin to hear the stories everywhere of what the Lord has started doing in this nation. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, precious Holy Spirit. We give you praise, Father. We love you, Lord. We give you praise, Father. We love you, Lord. Thank you, precious Spirit. Shall declare your glory, every knee shall bow at your throne. In worship, you be exalted, O oh Lord. And your kingdom shall not pass away, always yet. 
Oh! 